Hello everyone, this is Iqbal Khan and today I'm going to be working on Maples and Aces. Uh, Mandy Artem from Australia has requested this. So this is uh, just for you, Mandy, in South Australia. And uh, those of you who are new and visiting, please subscribe and hit that bell. Right, the tree that I'm working on now is a Desojo maple. As you can see, it's breaking into leaf, beautiful red leaves. I've had it for a number of years and I've let it grow. I wanted to develop the branches and also the new branches to thicken. And it is now time to prune them back. The gap between the nodes gets longer and longer if they are left to grow like this, which is not good for the tree. And for that reason, they need to be pruned back. And I'll do a close up and I'll show you how we prune these trees. Now here, there are a couple of nodes. The next nodes, a set of nodes is here, here, and here. And as the branch gets longer, the distance between them gets bigger. And I'm going to uh, sort of uh, focus in on this area here. And I'll be pruning it to here. And you'll be able to see that there are two nodes here and they will then grow out and from in between uh, either side of the cut branch will be the new growth. All right, so we're going to cut here and that's, this, these are the two nodes. So I'm going to leave uh, plenty of space as they will be die back. So that's what it looks like. And I will re repeat this process throughout the tree. And where you have a lot of branches, here I'm going to take out this stronger branch and leave this, this one. The idea is to keep the branches compact, otherwise they get very thin and long. So this way, by removing the stronger branch, this is a shorter branch, it has a chance to take over the energy from the other branch. Okay. The next branch that I'm going to prune is this one. As you can see, it's quite long and it's got quite thick, thick here. That was the idea, to get the branch to thicken up. And I'm going to, uh, there are a couple of nodes here, very, very tiny, but they are visible to my eye. And the next set of nodes is here. So you can see the distance from that node to there and from this node to there is starting to get bigger. And I'm going to cut it back to there. We'll, we'll sort of uh, zoom in. Okay, so I'm now going to, as I said, the, there are nodes here on either side. So I'm going to prune it to about there, allowing for a little bit of dieback. And uh, I will continue pruning and we'll catch up. I won't do any more close-ups. You get the idea as to what's needed. So I'm just going to continue fairly fast and do what is necessary. Okay, we are virtually there with this tree as that's as much pruning that I'm going to do today and uh, also removing the growth which is coming directly from the trunk new growth uh, that makes a tree look juvenile and it's the what we're trying to achieve is the other way around in fact so I'll just remove this one That's all for today, folks. I'll give the tree a quick turn. And uh, there we are, that's where we started. The work that I did earlier was uh, in the spring and it's exactly three months to the day. And this is what it looks like. It is summer now and uh, the crimson leaves are turning to green and they will turn to orange red before they drop off in the autumn. I will give it a quick turn. There we are. It is full of uh, foliage. I've had to prune it again just before doing this update. And that's where we started. That's the front. Thanks for watching. And if you're new and visiting and have watched this far, then I take my hat off to you. And I want you to do me one more favor. 
by hitting that subscribe button and ringing the bell and you'll receive all my future uploads and my future updates and what's more it's absolutely free thanks for watching this is Ekbal Khan for Mick Bonsai in West London until next time and now for the afterthought being a modest man when I checked into my hotel on a recent trip I said to the lady at the reception I hope the porn channel in my room is disabled to which she replied no it's regular porn you sick bastard I'm waiting for the plane to so finish making its noise and be far enough the birds are making enough of a racket